This is um, my favorite way of making a round loaf of challah. You start with your dough and you cut it into four equal pieces. And just like with a regular braid, you take the dough and you kind of make your Play-Doh style snake. So just whacking it around to try and get a nice long hollow dough snake. I actually learned this braiding method at the Jewish Music Fest from Chabad of Litchfield. Um, they had a hollow baking area and the girls there were doing it this way and I thought this was just the most awesome way to get a beautiful round loaf of challah. So I'm going to keep these two strands in the center. I'm going to take this one and I'm going to put it over the one on the right and under the one on the left. Almost like I'm making a woven tic-tac-toe board. Then I'm going to take this one and because this one went under, this one's going to go over this left strand and under the right strand. And I'm going to kind of scooch them together so that I don't have a hole in the middle. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my ends and I'm going to weave them around. So under goes over, under goes over, under goes over, and the piece that went under goes over. And then I just kind of tuck those pieces in underneath using my fingers. And these last four strands, I just kind of tuck in by themselves as well. Kind of loop it so it looks pretty and then tuck it under. I'll wrap that one and tuck it under and wrap that one and tuck it under. And there you've got this beautiful round braid that looks just gorgeous when it's done baking. For other great tips about Hala, hala braiding, crafts, crochet, knitting, and all sorts of fun. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel, like me on Facebook, and visit thelindsaylife.com. See you next time.